All right, so we're back with the wire cutters, and we're going to try to clip the rest of the wires off. Oh, these are dull wire cutters. <laughs> Sorry. It's all right. You know what? I might be able to use them to pull through them. Nope, I can't do it with these. Oh, but I can pull it through. There we go. There. All right. Getting somewhere here. I don't know if this will go through though. There's one part, and I'm stabbing myself right now. Oh, no, I didn't work. Oh, maybe this works now. There. Okay. <laughs> Not too sure how I'm gonna get it through there because it looks like the hole has started to close up a little bit, and I can't actually. I don't want to just pull it through because I don't want to damage the shell any more than it already is. And just so we know this little puppy just came from uh, a guy standing in PetSmart trying to get rid of his puppies to whoever would take his puppies and this one here as you can see a very skinny little puppy so I wasn't gonna let it stay with that guy so I took her in. Oh there we go. There. You wonder what goes through people's minds sometimes when they decide, hey, I'm going to drill a hole in my turtle so they can't run away. There. There we go. That's what it looks like without it on. See, it's drilled right, right through. Poor guy. I can't imagine the tortoise like that when he was drilling it, so. Alright. Well, I'm not going to do video of the whole thing because that would just take forever, but just thought I would let you see that. You can move over here. There you go. Alright, well, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, you want to see more about this tortoise tonight, you can go to my website, www.reptileguy.ca. Thanks for watching.